everyone, I'm going to do a what's in my bag video. I was tagged by Anika. I'll link her channel right here. Go check her out. She's really, really nice. Um, she's got a very nice channel and um, she has very nice videos. Um, for those who are watching my videos and um, like them, you like her channel as well. I'm going to do uh, the tag and hopefully you'll like it, Anika. Let's start with the bag itself. I used to have a Pierre Bellman bag, but the thing is, the material is coming off from the bag. Um, it's really ugly now, uh, so it was just in time that I got a present and this is my present. Nice, eh? Uh, to tell you the truth, I have no idea what the model is and everything. Uh, so I don't think that it will be helpful if I search for it as well. If you guys are interested in what it looks like, it looks like this. Uh, you can try to find it on the coach website. I have never bought anything as expensive as this. Um, this is my first expensive bag. But I like it. I really like it because it's very roomy. See that? But it doesn't really hold its shape well. But I really, really like it. And it has a single uh, strap which I like. And there's a zip right here. And I like the simple design, I really do. I don't like um, too many pockets, too many things on the back itself. Um, I just like it plain and simple. I really like this design. Okay, so what's inside the bag? There's, um, there's a few compartments here and there. There's the, what is this? The coach authenticity thing here. And there's a zip um, where you can store stuff. And then on this side, there's a few compartments. So let's start with the front pocket. So the front pocket, you open it just like so. Like that. So what I have in here is Panadol. Just in case, you know, I'm having a headache or my husband is having headache. It's easy um, and I'm like a walking pharmacy in some way. In my previous video, I'm not quite sure whether I have mentioned this, but this is part of what I'll have in my bag. This is my Nintendo DS. I have a few games in here, and then there's one that I'm doing right now, which is a Sudoku um, challenge. Uh, I'm doing that, and then um, I have some other games. I like the fact that I can bring this around because usually I'll be very bored when I'm in the car. Um, let's say for example if I'm stuck in a jam or something. I really like to have my Nintendo DS during those times. And most of the time, let's say for example if you're waiting um, at the doctor or... And it's taking forever, it's a good thing to have um, your... A Nintendo DS or a PSP. Um, I alternate between uh, my Nintendo DS or my PSP. It's a really good investment. So most of the time, I'll have this in my bag. The next thing is um, this, which is supposed to be all rolled up. This is actually a bag. We have like a no plastic bag day um, on every Saturday, and it'll cost you twenty cent in order for you to get. Rather than that, um, just buy this one. I think this one costs five ringgit or five ninety nine in Guardian, and you can purchase um, these kind of bags um, at almost everywhere at the moment. You can buy in uh, in Giant. You can buy in uh, Carrefour, and there's all sorts of colors. There are also some that are sold in uh, Parkson, so you can purchase them there. Um, it's really really functional um, in case if you're not shopping but you have to carry something that this would come in handy. When I moved my um, things from my old bag into my new bag, um, there will be some things like this. Um, some receipts, bank receipts and then loose change. Another loose change. This is one ringgit. Malaysia. A pen. Uh, 
have, what is this, a Silky Girl Perfume 9 to 5. A hand sanitizer uh, from Guardian. This is the lavender. Doesn't smell that great. I like the Dettol hand sanitizer more. My favorite thing. One of my favorite things. My calculator from Canon. Um, I use it most of the time. This is Flixonay's uh, nasal spray. It comes in handy um, when I go to my parents' house because they have cats. Every time I go there, um, I'll be sneezing all over the place. So to stop that, two spritz and I'm okay throughout the day. A Siba Med SPF 30 Lip Defense. I just bought this recently uh, and I really like it. This is for dry and chapped lips but this is really good because um, when I put it on, my lips feel really moisturized. Vicks, I should get those um, bag organizers. Tell me where to find them. I don't know where to find them in Malaysia. I don't want to buy anything online. Um, I just want to get them probably at a store or something. Just let me know where I can get those. Leave it in the comments below. A bigger one this time. Oh, this is the lubricating and rewetting drops from Renew. It's all fuzzy. A mirror, sort of like the model mirror. It has lights. Really comes in handy. I bought the Tony and Guy. Uh, I think I bought the shampoo, and I bought a certain amount. And they were giving the mirrors for free at Watson. But I don't think that promotion is on um, at the moment. It was a long time ago that I bought them. What else? Oh, torch light for when you go to the cinema. Or um, if you're having trouble finding your, your stuffs under the car seat. <laughs> Have you ever had that problem too? That you had to use your phone's backlight? Well, that happened to me so many times. This is the Cetirizin Stada, which is an allergy medication. A pair of earrings. Um, sometimes I just wear it under my hijab. Hand and repair care from you, boss. A small sample size. My room key at my parents' house. Um, there was supposed to be a mask here, but... It has um, broken off. Then there's a uh, machines card, uh, name card. What else is there? Pins that you uh, that you use for the hijab. Um, I used to have it in my old bag. I'm not sure whether I want to put that in the new one. Um, and I used to have those small. Um, you know the flower uh, pins as well still don't know whether I want to put it if I do want to put it in my new bag I'm not sure what should I put it in um, probably a you know a small box or something like that, so I need to find one last but not least my makeup bag usually I'll fill this with um, whatever that I'm wearing on that day for example I have very sensitive eyes so what I'll do is I'll put the eyeliner that I used that day into the makeup bag and then uh, probably a small brush with it as well. This is the Eco Tools, what is this, the retractable brush. This is a blush brush and it looks like this. Very small, cute brush, very dense, really handy. The next one is, uh, this is Water Shine Pure from Maybelline. And this is how it looks like. I'm wearing this one right now. So I add a little bit more. I like this lipstick because it's very natural. Um, if you want to darken it, you can do that with um, a lip gloss or even a lip liner. Um, oil control film by Clean and Clear and it's all grubby because you know I put it in here and it's, it gets knocked around. Some tissues. 
lip gloss this is the one that I mentioned if you want um, the lipstick to get a bit darker you can put this one on top whatever lip gloss just a little bit darker than the lipstick itself see it turns into a very nice shade this is the alien to blush pot in dusty rose I really like it it's quite bright but if you blend it out really well it doesn't translate that much of a color on your um, your cheeks lip smackers lip balm another lipstick from this one is from Inovi this is the Molux lipstick in seduce it has sort of melted on me see that it's kind of melted on me it's weird that's all I have in my bag. The other thing is just this one. This bag comes with a long strap. I don't use it. I'll just put it in the bag just in case I need to use it one day. Um, so I just leave it in the bag. And that's it. Oh, yeah. I forgot. The last thing that I have is my wallet, uh, which is from... I don't know um, Roberto or something so I have this wallet I usually keep a 50 to 100 ringgit in the side pocket um, it's for emergency purposes uh, just in case I forgot to uh, take money on that day or I need it for um, some sort of emergency and I don't think you need to see it I'm hoping to get uh, the wallet from coach um, that you know that has almost the same color as this one but the one that I saw the other day it cost 900 ringgit oh my god it's pretty um, it's long it's not folded like this one um, it is the long type and then there's a zip around it um, it's really really pretty but it cost 900 ringgit and um, the other day um, Coach was having a 50% off sale and it's still 450 ringgit. I still can't um, find a reason to buy a small purse or small wallet for 450 ringgit. That's just, that's just a bit too much for me. Um, I'm not judging anyone else. It's just that uh, for me, it's a little bit too expensive. But I really do like it. I really want to buy it. Um, probably I'll need to save up <laughs> a lot of money just to get um, the wallet um, one of these days I can try to buy it 900 ringgit pretty expensive huh <laughs> that's everything in my bag I hope that you like this video and I hope that it has been helpful for those who are interested to find out whether you know what sort of things I have in my bag what are the essential things that a person would have in their bags this is one of the most essential ones a hand sanitizer make sure you have this one in your bag nothing interesting um, nothing that weird I think the only thing that's weird is probably this one um, the Nintendo DS and a torch light um, anything else that's weird no I'm just a walking pharmacy <coughs> anything uh, for allergies or anything like that it's all in my bag thank you so much to Anika for tagging me in her video um, hope you like it girl and I hope to see you very soon I'm going to tag super XOXO star um, the other one is Erica Erin and then I'm going to tag wishlist and then cool mom 6 and there will be a few more people that I'll be tagging and I'll put them everywhere in this video right now. I'll put their links as well in the box below just in case you guys want to see what their channels look like. Um, they are very nice people. I really really like them. Uh, they've been very supportive of my channel and so have all of you guys who are watching me right now. At the moment, I have uh, more than 250 subscribers. Ah! So exciting! I, I'm very very happy that you've been supporting me by watching my videos and everything. I'm very glad that there's a lot of views on my um, follow me to Sephora Malaysia 
um, video. If you want to see some other things um, on my channel, let me know as well. Um, if you want me to review on anything that I've bought recently or previously, um, let me know. I hope you guys have a good week and a good lunch or breakfast or dinner right now. Um, I'll see you guys very soon. Bye! I've got to show you um, my makeup of the day today. Um, of course, you know what's on my lips. I've already mentioned it just now. Um, it was the uh, Maybelline Pure, um, Maybelline Water Shine Pure in Natural. On my eyes, I have uh, Teal Pigment from MAC, as well as Blue Green Pigment on the outer corner. Um, and I've lined my eyes with uh, Bobbi Brown, gel eyeliner in black ink um, on the inner corner I have I think something from stage I can't remember what's the name of that color um, so I put that in the in the inner corner if you guys are interested in this makeup look just let me know and I'll try to squeeze a tutorial for you and I'll see you again very soon bye Yeah.